welcome to part four of my resistance bands and dumbbells tutorial. In this video, I'm gonna be going over side lunges and forward lunges. It's gonna be a little tricky, so do your best to follow along. All right, so I'm gonna show you two different ways to do the side lunge and one way that I like to do the forward lunge using the resistance bands and the dumbbells. Um, for these two exercises, the, the resistance bands is pretty much just to add a little element of stability. It doesn't really add too much in terms of actual strength. Um, but I still like to use it sometimes just to add, like I said, a little bit more challenge to my workouts. So when it comes to the side lunge, um, I'm going to first show you the way that I like to do it when it's going to be on the moving foot, which means the lunging foot. All right. So I'm going to put it around my neck as usual. Now the two different ways you can put it around your neck, like I've said in the other videos, is either like around completely around my neck or crossing over like a sash, right? Whichever one you prefer. I'll show you the one crossing over like a sash because that's the one that I like to do. After it's over like a sash, I secure it under my foot. Now I secure it under my foot. I grab the dumbbells and I'm just gonna side lunge. That's why you wanna make sure it's secure to your foot because it's gonna be under the moving foot. You don't want it to slip out under your foot and smack you. So now you can do your side lunge. Boom, easy. Now you could also do it under the stagnant foot or the foot that's standing your supporting foot. Same thing goes as usual. You can either put it completely around your neck or like a sash. Once again, I'm gonna show it to you like the sash because that's the way that I like to do it. Always make sure it's secure under that foot. I'm gonna flip it around. Make sure it's nice and secure. I'm gonna grab my dumbbells and then lunge out. Boom. And that's pretty much it for the side lunge. Now for the forward lunge, there's only one way that I do it, um, and that's around, once again, either like a sash or completely around the foot, I mean, completely around your, your neck, but it's gonna be under the foot that's moving, under the lunging foot. So, put it under whatever leg, whatever foot you're gonna be lunging with. Uh, as usual, I'm gonna show you with it around me like a sash, because that's more comfortable for me. But you could do it the other way if you prefer. Grab the dumbbells and then just lunge forward. Boom, lunge forward, come back. Remember when you're doing lunges, you wanna keep your feet hip width apart. That helps with stability and balance. And that's pretty much it. I take it off my foot and that's pretty much it. That's how I do my side lunges and my forward lunges using resistance bands and dumbbells. As usual, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.